Let's talk about shepherd's purse, a common weed that grows around the world, which is good for bleeding and on heart disease and cholesterol and all kinds of things. It's just an amazing thing and it's edible and tasty. Dr. Paul Hader, Master Herbalist, get healthy now. Hi, Dr. Paul Hader, Master Herbalist and Health and Wellness Instructor for 34 years. Wow. Let's get healthy. If you like what I do, please give me a thumbs up. Please sub subscribe and tea. please tell other people. Let's get everybody healthy. Shepherd's first. You probably have it growing in your yard <laughs> somewhere. It's a weed and it's very edible and very tasty. Used in Chinese cooking a lot and around the world in cooking. And it's another free food that you can have and it grows just about anywhere. And it's been used successfully for thousands and thousands of years. And it really does work for a lot of different things. It's in the same family as you know, broccoli, cabbage, radishes, all these saphonamide uh, groups, which are really good for the health in general. Also, it's an immune stimulant. It's really good for um, inflammatory diseases and things like Crohn's and colitis and all kinds of different things. And even for atherosclerosis, it is amazing. It has a huge amount of antioxidants and it's anti-inflammatory, which helps to, you know, help prevent just about all diseases for sure. And it helps with bleeding. You can use it externally, you know, if you cut yourself shaving or something, and also you know, internal bleeding. And so it's been used for thousands of years for that particular purpose for sure. Like fungal and also antibacterial and it helps with antibiotic resistant bacteria, which is a real plus. We have a lot of those right now. See all the scientific uh, studies down below, and there's a huge amount. It's been used for a long, long, long time. And also in indigenous tribes, it's used for stomach aches, stomach aches and diarrhea and all kinds of things. Also good for, you know, little su superficial burns, also nosebleeds and uh, skin injuries in general. Also, it's really good for boosting up the amount of iron you, you, uh, in your blood, so it helps with anemia and uh, that type of thing also. It dilates blood vessels. If you have high blood pressure, it helps in that way. Also, good for the heart and heart disease and helps to, you know, if you have circulation problems, this will help in general. Also helps with arthritis because it's anti-inflammatory and also bladder infections. It really helps with that because it's antibacterial. Also helps with vaginal infections and heavy menstrual periods and postpartum bleeding and all kinds of different things like that. Also, it's a good diuretic and lowers cholesterol and lowers blood sugar a little bit also and really helps with lots and lots of problems that really are fantastic. Some people will use it as an alternative to ginger. It is kind of peppery tasting and it is very edible and tastes very good also. It has a lot of vitamin A and C. It also has uh, omega-3 and 6 in it, which is great. In an ointment, it's really good for hemorrhoids and also works well for psoriasis. Uh, it has been used for MS and liver toxicity all kinds of different things. The plant is edible. The roots are very tasty. All the leaves are, are, are wonderful. It has a little tiny seed, which kind of looks like a heart. They say a purse. Uh, I think it looks like a heart, but it, uh, you know, I was in an agronomy team and that was one of the things that you could tell it by. The seeds grow latent. You know, they can be in the soil until the right conditions come along and they can be there for years and all of a sudden they'll come up. And so it's just amazing stuff. And it, it grows just about anywhere, you know, if you happen to, you can get the seeds and you can plant it also. Not for those who are pregnant, nursing or small children. I don't recommend that at all. I recommend it for people taking blood thinners or also sedatives and medications in general. I, I don't recommend it. It has been used successfully for thousands and thousands of years. Uh, but it can cause a sedation kind of effect in extremely high doses. But in normal uh, doses, which I'll get into in here in a minute, it's really pretty safe stuff. Anybody can have a allergic reaction to anything, and some people do to this, but that's not very common. 
comes in all kinds of different forms, capsules, extracts, tinctures, also ointments. You can make your own ointments, all kinds of different things. Dosage, about 900 milligrams, one to three times a day. Uh, I recommend no more than seven to 10 days and then lay off of it. Pretty inexpensive. You can get it on Amazon, uh, 90 capsules for $25.99. Uh, it's very inexpensive, and it goes a long ways. The one I like is Nutrition, which is on Amazon. Uh, N-A-T-U-R-E-T-I-T-I-O-N. N-A-T-U-R-E-T-I-T-I-O-N. And they make, it has no ad, added supplements or, you know, any fillers or anything like that. It's just pure, uh, shepherd's purse which is fantastic once you get it going once you start growing this it's going to take off and like i said it grows around the world and it started in europe but it kind of spread everywhere and it will do that so make sure you want it <laughs> grows in cracks and crevices of the sidewalk it'll grow just about anywhere there you have it shepherd's purse edible and has a lot of Amazing healing effects that it can happen, help with, also helps with, I can't say that here, but it also helps with that too. If you have something going on, give me a call at 831-869-9119, 831-869-9119. I've had people, I had a man this morning called me about arthritis and we're going to reverse that for sure and get rid of it. And what's get rid of the cause instead of taking something and get rid of the symptoms. I want to reverse it for your rest of your life. 831-869-9119. And remember God, remember I love you. It says in one of the great texts, refuse no food to those who are hungry. And this is super important. You know, we have a huge amount of hungry people in the world. We can make this end. I love you.